Max and Yuri, co-founders of Wallchain. Uh, yeah, our backgrounds include Google, Meta, Grammarly, and Y Combinator. Uh, Wallchain is a Web3 cashback and anti-bot solution. We pay Web3 users cashback when they trade on exchanges like Uniswap. Yeah, so my name is uh, uh, Max, Max Bavza. Um, I did a lot of uh, algorithms and uh, programming from the early childhood, and I'm really excited about the uh, blockchain space. Previously, I've been an engineer at Google, Facebook, Grammarly, and uh, here I'm uh, at the blockchain space with my machine learning um, knowledge, uh, trying to democratize MEV at Wallchain. Blockchain and DeFi is a dark forest. Users uh, trade their money and uh, a lot in, in a lot of the time they've been attacked by bots. 50% of DeFi volume are bots. Bots make money on users. They pr profit from users and profit from protocols. Uh, this space is also called MEV and we decided to democratize MEV and bring this profit back to users and protocols because they are the main character in the blockchain world, in the Web3, and we want to reward them uh, because that's their power, that's what they deserve. Uh, yeah, so for the hackathon, usually it's uh, really exciting and it's really nice to build something that, that you can do and uh, show users in 24 hours. And basically from nothing to you go to something that is uh, really working in 24 hours, that's a lot of the uh, excitement and that's a lot of the uh, belief in something that you can create really quick and actually change the world. So hackathons are amazing and really, really interested in those. I'm uh, really interested in hackathons in blockchain, so uh, doing some um, decentralized application on the uh, blo blockchain, especially the BNB chain, the really fast-growing chain, that would be a really interesting uh, approach and uh, something that I would join. So definitely building decentralized applications on the blockchain, that is something to look forward to on the hackathon. Yeah, we are absolutely excited. We see a lot of opportunities here. Uh, even though B BNB chain is already huge, we see even more growth potential potential for it. That's why we are jumping in and we are already have like 90% of our volume on BNB chain. And we can see it rapidly glow growing as long as BNB chain grows. The future challenge, I guess, is a uh, real adoption of Web3. Like as uh, CZ said, uh, in the next few years, 8 billion people will be in crypto. And uh, I guess making uh, like regular experience that uh, that p people do on in Web3, on BNB chain, making it seamless and smooth for people in Web2. So it would be as easy to use like Facebook or Instagram. It would be as easy to trade in DeFi on BNB chain. So for the, um, the huge problem and uh, for, for the blockchain, and that is something that I'm looking forward to solving is uh, the mass adoption of the, uh, for the users. Blockchain is bringing a lot of the value for users and it's democratizing the finance world to make sure that everyone uh, it's accessible for everyone but there is a small pieces that are missing uh, that kind of separate regular users like plain users that i just want to do their finance and the blockchain space and those tiny pieces are something that we are missing and i'm interested in finding those and fixing that so that we have a mass adoption for the blockchain okay that's perfect thank you very much thank you, thank you. Very much. Thanks for having us. So my name is Michael Sebastian Serraro. I am 25 years old. I live in Romania, Brasov, and I have been uh, working in Unreal Engine uh, development for like six years now. And I've been a passionate gamer since I was a young kid. And, and I am really happy to be here. And I am finally chasing my dreams of creating this, this um, amazing game, fun game for, for the next masses. I, so my first project was actually a freelancing one, a freelancing project, a Web3 freelancing prop, uh, prop project. We have our own team there that are working on the uh, products basically. And since yes, last year in this December or November, something like that, we have started working on this one, on mummy.io, which is basically an action dungeon crawler type MMO R RPG game. And uh, yeah, we are building this game. We want to change the, let's say, add a new flavor to the crypto ecosystem when it comes to gaming. 
we we are focusing on bringing the web two players into the web three sides as well, and and we believe that this is the uh, the uh, future. I decided to start this project first of all because this was my dream since I was a childhood. So I was an MMO RPG addict. I played many games like Cabal, Decaron as well, World of Warcraft, Silk Road, uh, Black Desert Online. I, I played so many games, right? And I always wanted to have my own MMO RPG game with my own flavor in it. And I can do this with the help of the community, right? I need all the feedback that I can get from them. I, I need them to test our demo out. I want feedback because in the end, they are the ones that will spend hundreds of hours in the game and here, and we are here to listen at the same time while we are bu building this game. Our main goal is to make the game fun. It's really great. Uh, I mean, this is the first time when I, I'm like pitching live face to face with people and it's really great. Um, I'm, you, you, I'm usually that nerd or geek that stays in the room and he's working on, on the game, animations and blueprints and all of this stuff. I am not really used to like meet people, but this was a unique experience and, and I am really grateful to all of you first, uh, uh, first of all that I am here now and thank you, thank you so much. Our upcoming challenge is to actually, how should I say, it, uh, release a fun game, right? Because we need the support from the community. We need them to test our product in order to deliver a really fun game, right? And this is probably the most difficult like thing because many players, let's say, want something new in this genre, but they never come up with the feedback that you need or they don't come with the feedback when you need it. They always come at the later stage when you have already developed your game. And we are trying to reach all of these players now in the early stages so we can create together an amazing game. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.